suggestion finale. Hello everybody and welcome to the 31st and final Piggy Suggestion Review. It has been an amazing 31 days of Suggestion Review, everybody. That's pretty much an entire month. But with Piggy Chapter 12 coming to an end, it is time for a very special episode of Suggestion Review. I have gone back through time, all the way to the very beginning of popular suggestions, and I have searched far and wide for the best suggestions I could manage to find. With that said, let's just get right into it, Baby, first meme. This is literally like the first good suggestion I could find. Banana joins the battle. I'm surprised Minitoon hasn't added this. Banana is the peak physical evolution. Banana is what everybody should aspire to be. But you know, getting serious, definitely we probably wouldn't add Banana to the game because it's such a dumb, jokey skin. Personally, I'd love to see Minitoon do j dumb and jokey skins. It'd have to be way after chapter 12 is done. Maybe if Minitoon makes a piggy chapter chapter two, then Picky chapter one can have some funny updates, but I just can't really see it happening. But I love banana, eight out of 10. That's right, we're bringing him back. <laughs> this one's gonna be a good one. And I found one of the very first models people made of Mr. P. Now I'm pretty sure this is before he even showed up in chapter four. So nobody knew about him yet. And here we are. We've got this handsome man. Look at that giant mustache. That's a way bigger flex than the current Mr. P. Look at that top hat and look at that knife. You know, if I met that Mr. P in chapter 12, oh boy, I don't think I would have been able to finish the let's play. I would have just screamed and punched my monitor. But think about it. This is before Minitoon created Mr. P, I'm pretty sure. So what do you think? If you hadn't have seen Minitoon's Mr. P yet, and you'd seen this one, which one would you rather in the game? This Mr. Potato or that one? Here's the original image of Mr. Potato. Which one looks more like him? That's a real question. But I love how derpy it is. Eight out of ten George Piggies! We're gonna alternate. Robo the Laser! Once was a robot, now he's a Broken robot! Weapon! Laser from his eyes! Apparently the dark and light blue cannot be removed, so yeah. <laughs> oh, the the t missing texture thing? Also, just to clarify, his head is upside down, which may be why he doesn't resemble Piggy a whole lot. Why does it look like he's firing lasers from his crotch? By the way, this is the first robot skin I've seen. This is back when around chapter four came out. This is like Robbie version 1.0. This is the original Robbie. The original Robbie shot lasers out of his crotch. No, I'm not sure if the new Robbie's an upgrade or a downgrade, to be honest. Seven out of ten! George Pog! Now, I saw this suggestion as well, and surprisingly, I haven't exactly seen a suggestion like this. This is a bot difficulty settings for Piggy. It'd probably be a voting system, I suppose, so all the new players can pick easy and all that. But let's see it. Easy! You can easily juke the bot. It can't place bear traps and cannot find, cannot easily find players, for starters. Easy plus Oh, oh, they've got plus versions of everything. Easy plus, you can easily do, can't place, can find players. Okay, so I'm guessing for that, if you're in its line of sight, then it'll go after you. But if you break line of sight, it'll stop. So basically, easy plus is what we have for the bot right now. Medium cannot juke the bot. Can't place bear traps, but it can find players. But you cannot juke the bot. So you can't do the old twirl around it, which I think would be insanely hard. Because juking the bot is like the main way to win in this game. The only difference for medium plus is that it can place bear traps. Hard. You cannot juke the bot. It places bear traps in a smart way, so it'll put them outside vents, and it can find players. And then hard plus. It can find players, and it has smart movement. So I, I'm guessing the AI would be better. And yeah, he puts the problem right here. It would definitely be hard to script. AI is really hard to script in normal games, let alone Roblox. And to get to something like a, that's a next level bot for, that works for every single map and does a really good job, that'd just be insanely hard. So what Minitoon's done now is already a really good job. And Minitoon can add more difficulties or buffs. I'd like to see Minitoon add like, oh, if you pick hard plus, the bot gets a jetpack and it starts flying around the map. It zooms right into your face and then you just die. Ah, uh, here's another OG robot design. This right here could have also been Robbie's first model. I don't know why it looks like a bird cage and you'd call it a uh, robotic piggy. Yeah, this is inspired by the bionic piggy and I'm pretty sure bionic piggy is this one, but that's really awesome. I like how he has an ax too. Oh my God. 
god! That's terrifying! I had to look for the first scary skin I could find, and this was it. You know, it makes sense to be the first scary skin. It's like the original piggy skin, but with some really scary elements, and they do this really well. Look at that giant gaping mouth with those sharp, shredding teeth. Imagine, like, the moving animation. It walks after you, but its mouth just, like, ah. Uh. Uh, and it's got like a biting sound each time its mouth closes. That would be actually really scary. I would love to see that. 8.5 out of 10. Oh, who is this handsome potato? Oh la la, with the confident face and the confident smirk. Why, it's none other than Minitoon. <laughs> imagine, just imagine if Mr. Potato looks like that. If he actually was wearing Wearing, like proper Roblox accessories and had like the most confident smirk. How amazing would that be? Look, he's got like half a heart there. Why do you have to have the heart there? Why does it look like a dongly thing? But I like how Mr. P is like actual hair. <laughs> oh, it's actually kind of creeping me out. But who knows, mini tuned potato skin in future? Maybe, who knows? Eight out of 10 George Piggies. This is a very special one. This person right here, she guessed three maps. And not only that, her guess for the circus was actually like spot on. This is before Hospital came out. She guessed Circus, she half guessed Metro, she guessed there would be City. It was so insane. So let me show you. We're gonna have a look at what people thought the chapters would involve back then. And this is back when they thought there were only 10 chapters. Maybe because I said that. So for chapter six, I think we all have guessed is going to be a hospital. I suggest the beginning cutscene is you waking up in a hospital ward. That, uh, that happened. And each player wakes in a different bed. You of course have to escape. And the bot skin could be Dr. Brown Bear. She guessed it perfectly. Ending cutscene would be you running out of the hospital onto a train. That's like us going to the Metro. I swear Minitoon got some ideas from this person. Cause look at this circus. After escaping from the hospital, you catch a train, which brings you to the circus. That is 100% what happens? There you have to escape from Piggy with a clown skin. But look at that, there will be stalls and of course the central circus. That is exactly the, that's the description of the circus map. Uh, escape and the ending cutscene will be you and Bunny going out and spotting Mr. P again. Uh, unfortunately, they got that wrong. And then they then they get a few wrong, the supermarket, I guess it could be kind of like mall, uh, the pet store, but then, they guess the city, uh, but they guess it as a final chapter. And apparently we picked up some other animals, doggy, bunny, kitty, hen, hamster, and the pets fall down and hit their head and they become brainwashed somehow because they hit their head a bit too hard. I'm not too sure what's going on there, but I just wanted to point that out. That's what people thought of the previous chapters. You can pause if you want and have a look at those. She was very close with a lot of those. And I feel like many two might've been influenced by these early suggestions. Oh man, imagine that thing chasing you. This should have been chapter 12, dude. Piggy just comes flying in on a chopper and then parachutes down. She does, you know what, screw it. She doesn't even parachute down. She just jumps down from the chopper and lands like a superhero landing. What an absolute beast. Who wouldn't want this piggy chasing them? He probably wouldn't even have to get close to you. He just flicks the air and the air will literally put a hole in your stomach. Once again, that's not even a piggy model. That's a player model. It looks like it was stolen from like Fortnite. You know, maybe piggy times Fortnite skin. Uh, five out of 10 George piggies or I'm up to Gorge Pag. Okay, and now to everybody's most hated adversary. Baby Alexander, everyone. I had a look for the very first mentions of Baby Alexander. Where did this disgusting virus come from? And everybody, we've got three tiers of Baby Alexander. This is the very first mention of Baby Alexander. He's pretty much something to crawl through the vents and bite them, but it's a skin. That's the first mention of him. But then we go to the first add Baby Alexander to the game. Now he's crediting that original post, I'm pretty sure. That's the first time his image is there, that disgusting little creature. And then this is where it truly begins. This is the true start of that cursed baby Alexander model. The pram model. Disgusting. Disgusting! I made a baby Alexander Lil Walker. The first one I saw was like a Final Destination bot something. His jump scare will be him jumping out of the walker and biting the player in the neck, which is a funny face. And then I'll try to find a song to play when he appears. This is the official OG baby Alexander theme song. 
You guys want to hear it? The creepy ice cream tune. Okay, let's go. Let's hear it. This is the theme of our abomination. So basically, he wants ice cream. He, ba he thinks he's an ice cream truck. For all those creepers out there, creeper. Oh, man. Oh. I just wanted to point that out. That is the birth of the abomination. And until this very day, he still haunts our souls. That was the final suggestion review. That was the final piggy suggestion review. So for the future, I'm going to be doing a lot more Roblox based content. We're going to be moving away from piggy and onto Roblox in general. So we'll be doing lots of Roblox meme reviews. Um, I might do the occasional Roblox suggestion reviews. So if you have any awesome Roblox UGC hat ideas, game ideas, just suggestions in general for Roblox, come join our Discord and I'll have a channel for it. And if I don't have a channel for it, ping me and I'll make a channel for it because I'm lazy. But until tomorrow's video, goodbye!